Controlling the column layout for different responsive screen sizes in Elementor used to be less than ideal. You'd set your column layout on desktop, you'd be stuck with that on tablet, and then on mobile you could tweak things but you had to find an obscure hidden setting that a lot of people couldn't find, so it's still not great. Now I even made a video about a month ago showing you a little hack with custom CSS and there was even a plugin came out as well to help control uh, column layouts on tablet. Well, I'm delighted to say that the latest version of Elementor 1.5 makes all this way easier, much more flexible, much more powerful. So let's have a quick look at what's changed in Elementor 1.5 and how easily you can now control responsive column layouts for any screen size. Here's a four column layout I've quickly made in desktop view. So now let's drop to tablet mode using the responsive menu down here. So that's still four columns. Now previously, before Elementor 1.5, you'd be stuck with this without some custom CSS or a plugin. Well, no longer. Now let's say I want these to be in rows of two on tablet. So currently, each column is taking up 25% of the width. So for two side by side, I want each to take up 50%. So I'll click the column settings icon, which is now in a new place. And then over here in the column settings panel, you can see I'm now in tablet mode. And now you can just type in the column width percentage here. So I'll type 50%. And we need to do the same for the other columns as well. So same for column two. And three. And four. All right, now to mobile. And I mean, they're okay in one column, but just let's say I wanted maybe the first two to be full width but I wanted the last two sat side by side. It's very easy. So I'll, I'll leave the first two as they are. Scroll down to the third column, click the column settings, and we're in mobile view now, if you notice here with the icon. So I'll type 50% here. And then same for the last column. Let's type 50%. And just for a last bit of tidying up, let's hide this text widget on mobile only for these two final columns that are side by side. So we're still in mobile preview mode, so I'll click on the text widget to edit it. Uh, to hide a widget on different screen sizes, you go in the widget settings, we come over to advanced and down to responsive and select hide on mobile. Now, nothing happens to the preview here when you're in editing mode, but that's okay. I just, I'll just do the same for the last column. But it's when we preview that we see the responsive display settings properly. Okay, well, that was just a quick overview of how to edit responsive column layouts in the new Elementor 1.5. Way easier than before, far more flexible and very powerful. Have fun. To keep up to date with all my new training videos for non-coder designers, subscribe to my YouTube channel and do me a favor by liking the video and dropping me a comment below. My email subscribers get all my very best exclusive stuff. So hop over to designbuildweb.co slash my best stuff to sign up. Thanks very much.